Hope is here because January is considered the breakup month. So a lot of people call it quits. They made it through the holidays, and now it's time to say goodbye. Oh, I see. Before Valentine's Day, mm -hmm. but after Christmas. Right, I'm but breaking you. up is hard to do, as we all know from mm -hmm. past experiences. Yeah, like How the time you, you burn it? that guy's stuff in the okay, front yard. Maybe not the best thing, okay? So professional matchmaker Hope is here from It's Just Lunch with her six-month pregnant belly. Oh! Yeah. Hi, guys. We love you, Hope. Now, there's right and wrong ways to separate. There are. There are. So first is to be sure. Yeah. Make sure you're not acting on impulse. Okay. You know, setting things on fire. <laughs> now, it was a long time coming. That's why the fire gotcha. happened. Gotcha. Yeah. So, really think through is it an emotional choice or are you really going through and know, you know your reasons why okay. you're making the choice? So, make sure that you're really clear. Next right. is be honest with the person. Yeah. If you've been please. on the flip side of a breakup, mm -hmm. then you mm -hmm. know that mm -hmm. you can be left wondering or assuming and not really sure why it happened. So, don't dance around it. Just be straight on why it's not going to work out for you. Right. So that they're not. Left wondering what happened, mm -hmm. right. um, and then finally is be kind too, because you can be honest but still be kind to them, and you know not maybe not point out things that are just part of who they are, flaws that yeah. they aren't going to be able to change. So why point them out, <laughs> right? right? You right. have to be cruel. Um, a big one lately is don't make up to break up. Kind of the Justin Bieber, Selena Gomez yeah. trend that you see happening, where What's a couple, that? a couple will almost get into the drama of the makeup breakup cycle. Right. So they break up. Um, it's you know. They're angry, they're sad, then they miss each other, then they start courting each other, then it's exciting. Yeah. And the honeymoon stage is there all over again, mm -hmm. only to do it again. But it's a really unhealthy cycle to get in. And you see it more and more. You do. So stay away from that. Well, because it's hard, because you feel so familiar, and you're like, maybe they're changing, maybe I'll go back. Yes. But you have to remember the reasons why you wanted to break exactly. up with them in the first place. Exactly, go back to that and, and stick to your guns. Yes. And then finally is don't ghost or text. We've talked about both of yeah. these things before. That's you when you make off, us mad and we set stuff on fire. <laughs> if you just leave <laughs> and the person really could be worrying about you, what happened to them, or a text message, a text message that's very casual when really it, you know, you should be having a conversation about it. No, and totally. Either face to face or by phone. Be brave enough. You're dating. You're an adult. You should be able to talk to the person and communicate why it's not going to work out for you. All right, very quickly. But do you think people can stay friends after they break up? It depends on the couple. They but can. They certainly can. I know I have, and mm -hmm. I think that that is certainly possible. You keep in mind, though, if you if you're bad at breaking up, you won't be friends with anyone. That no, you break for up sure. With, and you'll leave kind of a path of destruction. Right. So it's better to be classy, and you know, be be nice, be kind, and if it's not going to work out when you're seeing someone. Right. Conscience mm -hmm. uncoupling. Mm -hmm. You communicate. <laughs> you're kind about it. Yes. And you just say we have to separate. Exactly. It's not going to work anymore. Let's not hurt each other. Mm -hmm. Let's just move on. Right on. Exactly. Sure way to do it. Right. Hope knows what she's <laughs> it doing. It took me a while to learn it. <laughs> For more information on how to get hooked up with Hope, and they do a whole nother level of dating and matchmaking, yes. you can go to itsjustlunchdenver.com. Uh, they're a great service in town. Good to see you, Hope. Good to yes. see you, guys. Good to see you, Hope. How are you feeling? Good. Good. Everything's good. good. Yes. Okay. We'll see you when next month. So June. 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 Oh, she's got months mm -hmm. to feel miserable. The baby's coming. Yeah, yeah exactly. June 1st.